Hi there, welcome everybody. It's Phil here from Hawkins. It's our latest property tour. We're on Tryon Road today. We're at this absolute cracker of a house, to be honest. Um, it's had lots and lots of improvements made to it. It's the bits that you can't see, unfortunately, wiring, um, plumbing, etc. But it's also got a new kitchen and a new bathroom. You've got a driveway there at the front as well. So, and one, there's a thing that they've had done on this as well. It was done obviously a few years back, um, but it's got external wall insulation. So it's all been rendered, all very smart. I've just been chatting to the owners on the, the pricing side. So a little bit more on, on that as well. So I'll pan around, show you what we've got. Let's dive inside then. There we go, there's the front of the house. There is a drop curb here. Um, they've set it up so there's one parking space, but in theory, you could have one just here, one on the side just there as well. A couple of nice houses just by the side. That heads down that way, further down into sort of um, Tomkinson Road and Hornshwood Road, just that way. Number 56, as you can see, it's a really nice looking house actually with all the rendering that's been done. Let's work our way across. Let's get in. There's UPVC doors on the front and the rear. There is an, an entrance hall just there. I'm just going to pop the door to behind me. I just want to show you so you can see. Um, they bought the property literally just over a couple of years ago. So you've got a bit of storage obviously just there. But you can see up there, that's the electric consumer unit. Um, and they've got all certificates and everything in place for a full rewire of the house. Um, so that is that is done. So the setup on this one, you've got the lounge on the front. It's full central heating, full double glazing all the way through. There's an electric fire in there with the wooden surround. A little bit of a recess just there. So there's quite a bit of furniture in here, but it's accommodating it pretty well. All been newly decorated, new carpets as well. The kitchen has been redesigned. Obviously that's on the back of the house. The kitchen would have been over there. Sorry, the window would have been over there. Start that again. The working um, sink unit and everything would have been over there. That's all been moved, so all new plumbing. The rewire's all been done as well. You've got some storage in here as well, which is really handy for ironing boards and hoovers. Really nice space in here. Very smartly done. Plenty of units. Really good space to entertain. And then you've almost got sort of a bit of a utility area just over here as well. Lots of light coming through, as you can see, as well. There we go. Right, let's pop upstairs before we end up back downstairs again to the, to the garden. Here we go. And new carpets, nicely done. Lots of storage in here. You've also got the loft hatch just up there as well. Two bedrooms up here. The main bedroom on the front, as you can see just there. Lots of space, that's a big bed. You've still got the chimney breast in. Lots of space sort of either side just there. And we just wiggle by round there. Over the stairs bulkhead as it would have been here. There would have been a wardrobe and unit in, but that's obviously gone in there now. So yeah, lovely big room, really good size. And then the second bedroom on the back of the house, just there, all newly decorated. And you've got the built-in wardrobe or built-in um, storage here. And that houses the, the, the boiler. The boiler's in there. That's a Worcester Bosch boiler that's gone in. So lastly, the bathroom all refitted fully tiled around the bath half tiled to the walls behind me you've got the shower over there very smart this is all fitted in neat and tidy there's a chrome towel rail just behind there as well all nice so right let's go and show you the garden all right so we're just coming outside I'll close the door behind me it's quite a big patio to here it's all neat and tidily done again as you can see there's the external wall insulation on there plenty of space at the side to come through and round nice size garden the tulips are out you can see absolutely beautiful and you've got the store shed just there and there's some raised sort of uh, allotment areas i think there's a little bit of produce coming through by the by the looks of things as you can see just come back up here Turn the camera around so you can see. Right, let's 
and turn the camera around and tell you a bit more. There we go then, thanks for watching that. Sounds like someone's out in the garden mowing the lawns. Um, perhaps after a busy bank holiday weekend, then uh, time to spend a little bit of time at home and, and get straight and sorted. This one's all been freshly done. It, um, you can tell the lawn's literally just been cut. So we're all set, ready to, to show this off for you. So thanks for watching that bit. Um, hope you'll agree with me. Really, really good house. There's lots been done, even in the short sort of couple of years that the, the clients have owned it. Um, not the biggest reason as to why they bought it, um, but what they found very, very good about living here is the external wall insulation on the property. Um, they had a flat that was over in uh, Coventry previously, and then they bought this one literally just over two years ago, and it's the same running costs from a two bedroom flat, which was obviously considerably smaller than running this house. Um, they've told me the figures, which I'll, I'll keep um, you know, um, they, they, they can explain on that side of things when viewings are taking place, but it's a very economical property. Obviously, it's had a new boiler. You've got the external wall insulation as well. They've got smart meters on and smart thermostats, so it all kicks into action when it needs to. And they've loved it here. They are literally only moving away with jobs, uh, newly qualified um, and ready to move away and start a chapter in a different part of the, the country. So it's available to go. There's no chain on this one. Uh, they're gonna move away and then buy something later on in due course. And they're available for viewings on this one straight away. So have a look online, your brochures, your spec sheets, floor plans, etc., are all on there. And if there's anything you're unsure of, do let us know and we'll do our best to try and answer any questions that you might have. So good location here. You've got amenities nearby on Hunchard Road and also Tomkinson Road, which are just at the end of either road that are here. There's lots of walkways just over the bridge where the railway line is. And that takes you through and around Whittleford Park um, where there's lots of tracks and trails, um, pathways, there's little lakes, ponds, um, etc. So that's very pleasant. I've done that one many, many times. You're only about a mile and a half away from the, the town centre as well. Um, schools are obviously well stocked within Stockingford, so no issues on that side as well. You've got the pull on, you've got the nice big garden, really, really good house. All you need to know now is the price. We're asking 155, 155 for the property. So um, if you'd like to come and have a look, do pick up the phone, give us a call through and we'll get you booked in on here. Don't forget, keep subscribing to our YouTube page. There's a link down here, click it, new properties, and you'll be first to know about them before they hit the main portals. So thanks for watching and take care. Cheerio, bye-bye now.